On the night of October 13, 2024, tragedy struck as Hezbollah, the Lebanese militant group backed by Iran, launched a daring drone attack on an Israeli military base near Binyamina. This assault resulted in the loss of four Israeli soldiers and left over 60 others injured, marking one of the deadliest incidents since the escalations began in October 2023. The attack was calculated and executed expertly, underscoring the deepening conflict between Israel and the militant group. Utilizing a dual approach, Hezbollah strategically deployed rockets targeting northern Israeli towns such as Nahariya and Acre. This tactic aimed to engage Israel's air defense systems while simultaneously unleashing a swarm of lethal drones, identified as Mirsad models, akin to Iran's Ababel T. The drones penetrated Israeli airspace undetected, striking a vital training base of the IDF's elite Golani Brigade, aiming for maximum impact through precision targeting. The devastating strike specifically hit a dining hall at the base, where the concentration of personnel further contributed to the staggering number of casualties. With a range of 120 kilometers and capable of carrying up to 40 kilograms of explosives, the Mirsad drones showcase the advanced capabilities of Hezbollah's arsenal. The Alma Center, a prominent Israeli security institute, highlighted these technological developments, raising questions about Israel's preparedness to counter such threats. Just prior to the attack, the United States had announced plans to send additional air defense systems and troops to bolster Israel's defenses. In the aftermath, the Israeli Defense Forces IDF acknowledged the breach, launching an investigation into how the drone swarm managed to bypass the country's typically robust defense mechanisms without triggering any warning sirens. Rear Admiral Daniel Hagari, an IDF spokesperson, reassured citizens of a thorough investigation to prevent future incursions. Hezbollah quickly claimed responsibility for the assault, framing it as retaliation against Israeli airstrikes in Lebanon earlier that week that had resulted in multiple civilian casualties. By invoking the legacy of its former leader, Hassan Nasrallah, they sought to position the drone strike as an act of defense rather than aggression. This incident reflects the ongoing and intricate conflict along the Lebanese-Israeli border, revealing the escalating tensions that threatened to spiral further out of control.